when I was in school, you know, I was very organized for the first week at least. And then as time went on, things got a little more messy and chaotic. But staying organized can help make learning a whole lot easier. And we're doing it the DIY way this morning with Katie. Good morning. Good morning. So these are tips people need to hold on to mm -hmm. for the whole school year. Yeah. Um, but you've made it easy. I see lots of uh, little compartments, which appeals to me as an, a neat freak. Yes. So where do we start? Okay, so we're going to start right here with we've all been there. It's 9 o'clock on a Tuesday, and it's like, oh, shoot. Shoot, there's a project due tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Uh -oh. <laughs> so the first tip is to have like a little storage uh, area hidden away where you have stuff like Bristol board and oh. cue cards and construction paper and things that you don't necessarily use every day. Right. But when you need them, you need yes, them, and so exactly. you're not running to the store at midnight or whatever to have a little <laughs> hidden area with all of these items. That's right. It's like, Mom, I'm Mom, Dad, I'm supposed to have a whole project done on the history of Canada by tomorrow. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. I've done that. I mean, everybody's done it, I think, and it's awful. That is but... a really great idea to have kind of a backup supply mm -hmm. handy, a lot less stressful. Yep. Uh, a lot of people find the whole packing the lunch thing stressful, right? Yeah, exactly. And it's just like in fitness or anything else, it's all about food prep. Have mm. little things prepped so that in the morning, grab them out of the fridge, right. easy. Maybe you're one of those ones that takes your uh, lunch money instead of an actual oh, lunch. So okay. again, prep. Put yeah. together uh, some like envelopes, envelope. one for every day, maybe oh, keep it on the Monday fridge lunch, or wherever. Awesome. And this goes for after school snacks too. If you have a bunch of stuff prepped, they'll come in, they're starving, they can just grab, you know, one thing right. rather than eat everything before dinner, just shoveling. This is a really good idea. They can like serve themselves type thing out of yeah. this kind grab, of Grab, you know, tote. two, three things, yeah. put it in your lunch and go. Good to go. Mm -hmm. File folder? Yeah, so this is for the parents. So come up with some sort of filing system at the beginning of the year that you can use throughout the entire year that you put everything from permission slips mm. and things like that in important paperwork because we start these piles on our counters or wherever and they pile up and then they end up lost and, and then what if it was it. a flyer about cookie day and you forgot to send cookies you'd be the worst <laughs> parent ever so just Keep yourself organized. And you could it's have very one important. for each child, too. Yeah, for you sure. Have one for each child. That's a cool idea. Mm -hmm. uh, this is cool. I see kind of like school supplies all in a tote here. Yeah, so that's actually a homework station. Oh. So, uh, that's the next tip is to put together a little bin that has stuff that's just everyday things, mm. pencils, loose leaf, mm. whatever, to have for when they come home and they do their homework. Right. You can grab it, maybe put it all over the kitchen table. But then when it's supper time and you want to get rid of the mess, you dump it back in and you store it away until the next day. To go. Keeps everything in one place and makes it easy when doing your homework at wow, night. Wow, what a great idea. And last but not least, oh, woman after my own heart, a list. <laughs> yes. I love lists. Yeah, so come up with a checklist for at night that works for you so that you can prep everything for the next morning. I actually printed this off and laminate it so that yeah. way you can use the same one day after day yeah. and then this is a little dry erase marker oh. and you can then go and check, check it all off, off each thing and you're good to go. And you get your child involved, right? Because this is like my homework is finished, my backpack is packed, my breakfast for tomorrow is for lunch, I plan to eat this. So that's a really great way to kind of get them in on it as well and yes. start that organization early. Actually, I need this for life. Okay, that's for you. <laughs> you can use that. I just need this in general. <laughs> Did I, what did I have for breakfast? Oh dear, that's already, I'm failing here. Okay, thank you so much You're for this. Welcome. Appreciate it. Of course, we'll post this online afterwards for you to review and make your own checklist, Elise.